The threat of a one-state reality endangers the founding vision for Israel as both a Jewish and democratic state. Israel cannot be Jewish, democratic, and control all the land at the same time. If it chooses democracy and the land, then it cannot be a Jewish state. Arabs will soon outnumber Jews between the Mediterranean and the Jordan. If it chooses to be Jewish and also to control all the land, then it cannot be a democracy. This plan B changes the whole paradigm. We don't talk about the two-state solution because it's dead. But what we do is look at the reality on the ground. And the reality is there are people, Palestinians, living currently in Palestine who are discriminated against. So it would seem to me that the best thing the Palestinians can do is to dissolve the Palestinian Authority and revert to direct Israeli rule and in a sense to say to Israel, here we are, you are ruling us, but you are pretending you're not. We are unequal. So we demand equal civil and legal rights as ruled by you and we demand Israeli citizenship. So therefore, the struggle, which is a futile waste of time, then becomes converted into a struggle against apartheid, something familiar to the world, something which we've been through.